Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Lauren. If you like the content, then I would love for you to subscribe. And of course, to all my returning subscribers, thank you so much for all the love and the support. You guys are honestly the best. Today, I have a very exciting unboxing for you. It's from Farfetch, and can we just look at the size of this box that it came in? It completely covers me if I try to. It's a massive box, so of course I got a bag in there that I'm really excited to show you. I'm also gonna talk about some of my summer essentials as well because the items that I got from Farfetch, I think, tie into the summer and the warm weather really well, and I'm so excited for that warm weather because honestly, I'm done with the rain here in Vancouver. So um, I'm gonna start with the Farfetch items first because like I said, I got a bag and I really, I just need to show you it. So if you're new to my channel or you just haven't heard about Farfetch, let me briefly tell you about them because I am addicted to that site and I stalk it daily. So it's an online platform that connects you to over a thousand different small boutiques, larger department stores, um, different luxury brands, different contemporary brands, all around the world. So whatever you're looking for, you're like 99% guaranteed to find it on that site. I think everything that I've looked for has been on there. There's never been an item that I've searched for that I couldn't find. And the cool thing about it is shipping is so fast. So every item that I've got has come within, I think three days. So shipping is really fast. And the other cool thing that I really like about it is it includes duties and customs and taxes, whatever. The price you see when you check out is the price you pay. There's no hidden fees. And I always stress that because here in Canada, sometimes I order from sites and then I go to pick it up at the post office and it's like, oh, you owe $36 in duties. And I'm like, what? Farfetch includes it all. Definitely go check out the site. Um, I'm gonna show you the items. Like I said, I love it. I stock it daily. You definitely need to check it out if you are into like a lot of different luxury brands. And I also find that the prices tend to be cheaper than if you were to get it from other sites. So if you can save money and get what you want, definitely do it. So I'm gonna show you the bag first because you know I'm addicted to handbags. In particular, I am addicted to Balenciaga bags. So you know I had to pick up a new one for the summer. So like I said, these are gonna be my summer essentials and I feel like in the summer you need a good tote and why not get a tote in a light color? So I got this one here. It's so cute. So this is, like I said, by Balenciaga and this is the city's tote and they have multiple different ones but I got the one that says Paris because that is on my bucket list. I really want to go there. So I originally saw this on, I think her name is Susie Binaldi. I can't remember her exact name, but I saw her and she unboxed this. I think she got hers from Farfetch as well. And hers was in the large size and she's really petite. So it was really large on her. So I knew I wanted to get like the smaller size in it. And because I'm working with Farfetch again, that means I have a new discount code for you, which I will link somewhere here as well as in the description box. So definitely check it out and save yourself some money. So I just took everything out of it and now you can see the size of it. This is actually very comparable to my Goyard St. Louis tote in the PM size. They are actually the same measurement. So if you are used to the Goyard tote, then this Balenciaga, the small city tote is the same size. The thing that I like about this one better than my Goyard is that the strap drop is fairly long. And I'll, I'll show you um, a couple of modeling shots um, so you can sort of see what it looks like on me for reference. And please excuse the mess. We just moved yesterday, so there's so much stuff that we need to put away and get into storage, but I just want to film this. So the outside is this beautiful canvas, which is very light. And then the handles are this matte black leather, which I appreciate. And then the inside is black, so that way no stains show. There is one large zippered compartment at the back. And this just has all the authenticity information and then there's also a very large pocket on the front which you can fit a, I don't know you could fit like a definitely a large phone in there and probably I don't know I feel like it almost feel like an iPad in there it's really big and then you also have um, a ring here so you can attach your keys this came to $1,200 Canadian and that includes all import duties taxes everything like that so I feel like 
that still is a fairly affordable air quote um price for a luxury tote because a lot of them are up into like the 2000s the 2500 dollar canadian mark so for a big tote that's perfect for summer i mean i definitely would recommend this one i always recommend balenciaga i've had nothing but like great items from them no issues at all so i'm so excited to use this and this came to me from the Netherlands three days it took to ship uh, it came from Browns a lot of my items that I get by Balenciaga come to me from uh, Browns in the Netherlands whenever I order from Farfetch so that's the first item that I picked up the next item that I picked up are a pair of sandals and they are by Marnie and I don't own anything by Marnie so I'm really excited that this is my first piece from the brand this shipped to me from Italy again three days from a store called called Nunez 1920 I hope I'm pronouncing that right but let me quickly show you and I think these will be perfect for the summer you can probably tell that I love the color green so when I saw these I had to get them they come with their own little dust bags like most luxury kind of um, sandals come with they are so beautiful this green it's a little bit different this is more of a vibrant green i would say it has the green and then it has um the fuchsia sort of accent and then it says marnie in a white these are called the logo print slides let me get the other one out so i can show you both of them so that is what they look like i think this will be perfect for the summer the top part of this sandal is fabric and there is a tiny bit of stretch to it which is really nice and i appreciate that because some luxury as well as contemporary brands the sandal can dig in and be really uncomfortable the bottom is rubber and it is really light um, which i also really like because some sandals the bottom can be so heavy and i just don't i don't understand they're supposed to be slides they should be light like all slides should be light so I really like these and if you aren't into the green and the pink then they also come um, in a neutral color so they come with white as well as with black so if color is not your thing and then you can definitely whoops get some of these in the neutral kind of colorway price point on these these came to a 292 Canadian including import duties taxes everything like that so I feel like it's coming under the $300 mark which is pretty good for a pair of luxury sandals and I did get this in my typical size 38 um, which I generally am I'm usually a size 7 when it comes to I guess North American sizes um, a size 7 or 7 and a half and I always get all my luxury shoes sandals whatever in a size 38 so really excited to wear those I just think they're gonna be so perfect when I have a tan again I will leave you my farfetch discount code right here as well as down in the description box those are the items I picked up from farfetch and now let's go over some of my summer essentials I have quite a few pieces to show you from Aritzia which is perfect timing because their clientele sale will be coming up the first item are a pair of light denim jeans and they have some distressing I think it's just the summer is a perfect time to really wear the light denim so these are by the house brand Aritzia's house brand denim forum these are the Joni high rise loose in the 29 length I have mine in a size 25 I will say these fit a little bit big so if you want it to be a little bit snug I would size down so I think if I purchase these again I'll go with the size 24 but the 29 length is perfect I do have a video where I show these on so I will link that down below for you but I think that getting any sort of denim when you can get it on sale at Aritzia is a good investment so this is the first item that I wanted to show you the second item which I feel like everybody knows about the contour um, bodysuits, but this is by Babaton, and this is one of their contour tanks. So if you're not into the whole bodysuit um, kind of vibe, then definitely look into their tanks. This is also a really sort of high neck. I really like that in the summer. So I feel like this with the denim jeans, with these, and the bag like I got a whole outfit set I'm ready to go for the summer um, this is just like such a great basic and you can wear it in the summer you can wear it in the winter as well with like a cardigan layered over top so I really like these contour tanks 
The next item I have from Maurizia was trending last summer and I feel like it was sold out for a long time, but I feel like it's gonna be just as popular this summer and that is the Divinity romper they also have the jumpsuit version which is the full length and i have that as well i haven't been able to wear this one yet the tags are still on it because i'm just waiting for the weather to be nice here in vancouver but it is just a romper but what i really like about it is the details so you see there's a seam sort of on the front and then there's a seam that sort of hits at your natural waistline and it just helps to suck you in and give you some curves if you even if you don't have any because I definitely don't and this helps me to fake it but um, it's really stretchy it's very comfortable it isn't see-through at all at least while the black isn't see-through for me if you're used to the atmosphere um, TNA life shorts I feel like the TNA life is sort of very similar in fabric to the divinity romper so um, this is just perfect for the summer. Again, it's just sort of like a one and done. You don't need to think about anything. You just throw on the romper, maybe throw on like a button up shirt over top and then you're good to go. And you can also dress this up as well. I've seen people wear this with blazers and then heels and I feel like it looks amazing that way too. So I get mine in a size extra small, which is the size that I wear in um, any of the TNA leggings or the bike shorts. So I just went with my same size. That's what my um, sales associate, who's also my really good friend, she recommended. Then the last thing that I wanna show you, I have multiple pairs of these from Aritzia, but these are the bike shorts. So I just grabbed, sorry, there's lint on it. I just grabbed this one here because it is my favorite. This is the TNA body and it is ribbed. It is pretty snug. So if you're looking for some compression, I would definitely go with the TNA body. I also have it in the TNA life as well as the butter and the slick. And I definitely like the TNA body fabric the most. These are also the five inch as opposed to the seven inch length. I like the five inch just because I'm a little bit shorter, but if you prefer to show less leg, then you can go with the seven inch or you can also go with the nine inch, but these are perfect. Again, I got this in a size extra small and that's the size I get in sort of all my leggings. Next item are another pair of slides. I wanted to give you a couple of different options. I believe I picked these ones up from Farfetch as well, but these ones are by Axel Arigato. Um, I have picked up a pair of their shoes and I really, I just like the brand in general. I think it's super cool. I don't think a lot of people know about them yet, at least here in like Vancouver. I don't really see anyone wearing Axel Arigato. It's all like New Balance, which I also love New Balance, but these are the slides here and it just says Arigato and then it says 2014. They are brown and there's that beautiful sort of cocoa brown, which I feel like is having a moment right now. So. These are them here. I can't remember the exact price point of these. Um, I will link them down below, but I know that these ones were also under the $300 mark. So if you are looking for some affordable slides from a contemporary brand, then definitely check um, these ones out. I got mine in a size 38, and these ones are, I would say, heavier than the Marnie ones. The rubber on the bottom here, I feel are a little bit thicker. They're almost reminiscent of, if you have any of their shoes, the bottom part is fairly thick. They're a little bit chunky. My XL Aragata shoes are a little bit heavier than my other sneakers, I would say, but these are just beautiful. So I will link these ones down below for you. The last item I have to show you is by a Sage. I've quickly become addicted to this brand. I really like Aesop products, but I love Sage. And I also love that it was founded in Vancouver too. So I love supporting a local Canadian brand. Um, this is the Yoga Mist. So what it's meant to do is it says the Yoga Cleansing Matte Spray. So I originally bought this for my husband because he, he has a yoga mat that he stretches and does exercises on and sometimes it can get funky smelling. So you just spritz this on top and it basically just helps to get rid of like the smell. But I have been using this just as a room mist in general. And this, if you want your house to smell like an expensive spa, 
this is the smell like i can't describe how good it is this is the second bottle that i actually purchased and then i took some and i put it into a small little um, spritz bottle and i keep that in my car so i just spray this i spray this in my shoes as soon as i get home as well so if you wear sneakers all day obviously they're gonna smell so i spray my shoes with this i'll just spray the air with this i'll spray the yoga mat i spray my car so really this is just such a good this is like my favorite smell such a good mist. I can't remember the price point of this. I think it was around 15 or 16 dollars Canadian and it's just amazing. Those are my summer essentials. I will link everything down below. Again, here is my Farfetch code. I will also link that down below for you. Definitely go check out the site because I mean, look at this beauty. You need her. You need her in your life. So thank you so much for watching and again for all the support. You guys are the greatest and I will see you in my next video. Bye!